Chicago Live. I welcome to the show, Ali. Thank you. You mentioned in that clip that we just shown the triple bottom line in business. What exactly is that? What does that mean? Sure. So conventionally, companies tend to have very singular motives and they tend to be very profit oriented. Of course, yeah. For us, what we try to do with CocoNet is have multiple objectives and those were our triple bottom line principles. The first one was obviously to make a profit. I think that's essential to every company. Uh, but the other two were to better the human condition and make sure that our project also helped other people, help better the lives of, of other individuals who are vulnerable, whether it be in North America or internationally. And the second objective, in addition to those two, was to help the environment. And I think that's becoming uh, more and more a problem and an issue that we need to try and focus on. When I found out that every 30 seconds a child dies of malaria, that it's one of the leading causes of child mortality, uh, that 500 million people are affected by malaria every year, but it's easily preventable, it's easily treatable. I, I just couldn't see how that could be, especially because there's such a high malaria incidence, it, incidence rate in the developing world. But in North America, malaria is pretty much eradicated. I saw such a dichotomy that I wanted to find something that could try and fix it. And that's really what led us to the CocoNet. What about people who say you can't make a profit if you're concerned about the environment and the human condition? You know, I think that's very often said and I think it's a misconception. Really? I, I don't see a reason why you can't make a profit and do well in terms of monetary success, but also do well in terms of how you help other people, being socially responsible, environmentally responsible.